But first, defending her neighbor, a Tarpon Springs mom's brave actions with her child just feet away. And the reason neighbors are now calling her a hero. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan. I'm Paul Legron and for Jamison Euler tonight, a Clearwater man is in jail and a woman has her neighbor to thank for saving her life. Yeah, all new at six. ABC Action News reporter Sarah Hollenbeck is live in Tarpon Springs to show us how a mom risked her own safety to help a neighbor. Sarah. Brittany Cheek, she did not hesitate for a single second. Just look at how close these apartment buildings are. When she heard her neighbor screaming, she ran across to the other side and immediately got her gun and was ready to help. That's why neighbors say she is a hero tonight. Just amazing bravery. Carolyn Lubecki is in awe of how her 31 year old neighbor risked her own life to step in when the woman across the hall screamed for help. The bullet hole in the store, a reminder of the sheer danger. But you kind of panic in situations and thank God she didn't. She just didn't think twice. Pinellas County deputies tell us this man, Daniel Morey, wearing only his boxers, started pounding on the door of this condo around four in the morning Saturday. Susan Bass noticed the man was bleeding and opened up her door to help. Instead, he attacked her. That's when Bass's neighbor grabbed her gun and shot Morley in the leg all with her three year old son just a few feet away. Some people are willing to get involved and some aren't. And thank God in this case, somebody did. We're all in that boat right now. It could happen to any of us at any time. Tammy Harrison owns a female oriented gun shop in Largo. She says her business has doubled in the past two years with women arming themselves with handguns. It kind of pushes you over the fence and it's like, well, OK, she protected her three year old. That could have been me. The Girls Gun Wild Shop offers four law enforcement taught safety classes a month exclusively for women. And it just kind of brings out the mama bear in you <laughs> and, and you know you're going to be OK. Neighbors here just grateful to have community members who care. The willingness to without question just help her neighbor in need like right away instantly without a thought. The weirdest part about this case, no one knows why the suspect was here in the first place. I talked to his stepdad tonight. He says he has no idea why he acted the way he did, but that he's going to let the judicial system run its course. Reporting live in Tarpon Springs, I'm Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News.